We made it, we finally got there all the way to Via Rebo Village. We spent 24 hours here meeting the locals, meeting fellow travellers, exploring and taking in all the sights that this lovely village has to offer. So come and join us. embark on our journey a little bit nerve-wracking we're not used to hiking for two hours but there we go we're ready packed and let's see where it takes us our last two days have been building up to this moment we're finally visiting this ancient and remote village called Vairibo the village is situated around 1000 meters above sea level part of which we're driving by bike the other part will be hiking It. Now it's time for a uh, two and a half hour walk. So it was 20 minutes from down by the beach where we stayed overnight, and now we got to the last checkpoint where you can drive. That means now it's a, no, it's two, a walk where we could drive up to here, and now it's a two, two and a half hour walk. Let's so, do this. Ready? Yeah, ma'am. Right, so it's 9 20 in the morning. Let's see how long it takes to get there. I'm saying about 11, full pass. like 20 minutes in I think already and uh, yeah it's just steep just literally up 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 uh, it's very pretty but boy is it uh, hot we're powering through go on Pat how are you feeling it's crazy sir it's definitely a hard one <laughs> for you hardcore tourists out there definitely do this <laughs> yeah, it's good. Make sure you wear good walking shoes. One sweaty mess, but if you like hiking and a little bit of something different, then this is worth it. How you feeling? Tired but happy. Look at this. This is incredible. <laughs> so I think we've got probably about forty minutes to go now, and. Uh, it's been, it's definitely been a uh, a bit, little bit on the steep side, I guess. Uh, but yeah, literally just powering through now. It's uh, it's really cool. It's nice to be part, and you get a beautiful scenery. Like it's really pretty. I just don't know what to expect what it to be like. Nice. <laughs> Me neither. But if it's anything like this, it's beautiful. The first leg of the walk from half an hour to an hour was quite steep on the legs and found it a little bit difficult. But as we got into the flow, the walk became so nice hearing all the birds and taking in all the beautiful views. I nearly lost trusted Fanny, fell out. Oh, that would not have been good. In the clouds, Phil. Hello. <laughs> we keep going. 20 minutes, so hopefully. Hopefully, we can get there before two hours. Before it's not a hours. race. <laughs> Change my t shirt once. It's just too hot. Yeah. It's completely drenched. Coming through the Raver Monkeys, properly on tour. <laughs> this has been an hour and 40 minutes of walking, and we're above the clouds, so you can see them, I think, over that way. And but also, we're doing it. Yeah, Sorry. it's just we're sort of saying it's so nice to do it together. I probably would do it by myself. But it's much nicer to do it with someone you love. Oh, I love you too. Yeah, I like to try and do it on my own, but I'll probably end up tripping over. I'm a bit accident prone. So, uh, but and yeah, this has been a proper adventure. I think more than anything else, this has been one of the, the highlights of the whole traveling trip, just to push yourself um, and try and find this really remote village that's hopefully going to be paradise. <laughs> like, so. yeah, just definitely. That's what life's about, right? <laughs> 100% now in the clouds. Temperatures dropped a little. Might put my jump on in a bit. That's the beginning there. Hey, boy. Hello, buddy. Oh, wow. Look at that part. <laughs> Just these four 
four, five, six, seven yeah. months. Yeah. Because uh, in main house we are we have eight family inside. And uh, in other house, six. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. How, and long is, how long does it take to make? <laughs> to, to make to make one of <laughs> One one year. One year to make yeah. wow. Beautiful. All yeah. thatched. <laughs> As soon as we arrived, we were greeted and taken to the main building where the locals usually have their rituals and ceremonies. As guests, we had a ceremony with the elder, thanking the ancestors for welcoming us in. We also learned about the traditional houses. Each one has five levels for storing food and seeds and offerings. Very blessed. Oh. <laughs> and what this is? This is like coffee and yeah. corn and coffee. And that's also like, is it very sacred? Yeah, very sacred to you. That's for offering also. When we make the big ceremony, yeah, we make it at the top. Oh, okay. I can't wait. Yeah, that's from 6 pm until 10 pm. Oh, okay. Just okay, continue cool. by the solar panel. Like this, the blue one. Yeah. Yeah. And then 10 o'clock, bedtime, yeah. <laughs> or, or singing, guitar. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> and then now, uh, for toilet and bathroom, we can follow this way, okay. take, a, take left, yeah. And shower? And Do you have a shower? Yeah, take oh, shower. Have oh, nice. If you follow this way, right side. Okay. Yeah, the position oh, behind the shoes. Okay. Yeah. And then for welcome drink, we have some coffee and tea. Okay. So how about not only did we receive welcome drinks, we also received a lovely lunch, which was rice, vegetables, omelettes, and some chicken and rice cakes. How's the food? Very good. God, hey, look at this feast. Oh. <laughs> That's a lot of rice. Yeah. I don't think we'll be finishing all that. We had a ceremony to thank their, um, their ancestors, and now we got given some food. And it's delicious. It's really sweet. The locals grow and harvest three different types of coffee bean, which were absolutely delicious when you had a little sample. Hello. Gentleman was just saying about different types of coffee. So you've got literally one here, two, and they're all that you grow here. I would have so much coffee. We passed quite a few trees, oh, didn't we? <laughs> the kids have a good life here, don't they? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I love that. <laughs> They've got their own allotment here. The papaya one. There's a cacao oh, tree. A oh, coffee tree, sorry, yeah. 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 That is like self sufficiency. Yeah. yeah. Home for the next 24 hours. For one day, we were privileged to observe and interact with the locals in their daily life. You get a really good and sense of idea of community here with all the families working together. We have learned that the members of the village are predominantly Catholic but still hold on to old beliefs. What do you think, though? It's pretty, <laughs> pretty amazing. Yeah. Literally up in the clouds, and you can see behind us, like a uh, Michael Jackson through the video. <laughs> <laughs> it is nice. Everyone has been really welcoming and super friendly. And even though there's a language barrier with some people, it doesn't really matter. They're super friendly and smiley. It's just nice. Yeah, it's I highly nice recommend coming here. If you really want to go and do something completely different from your normal. Yeah, and be shut off from. There's no Wi Fi, there's no connection. It's great. <laughs> just wear walking boots when you come here. <laughs> the trek was quite long wasn't it yeah two hours <laughs> but well worth it we met some slovenian guys that have done it in one hour so i guess we are slow but <laughs> it's not a competition <laughs> i can't wait for the fit tonight let's see what happens <laughs> If you make it into a little vacuum and then you'll fall in the middle. <laughs> oh, turn back a seat. Thank you. Oh, proper. <laughs> you weren't doing it strong oh, enough I wasn't there. Strong enough. I have to do it again like that. Mm. 
and I imagine all these get roasted. And that's going to be the coffee bean off there. Uh, Terry McAsee, thank you so much. If you want me to do more, say, Phil, come and do more. <laughs> I was just flirting with it before. You got a proper. Every day. And coffee business together. <laughs> uh, Terry McAsee, do you want me to do them more? Yeah. Big ears. <laughs> hello, hello, hello you, you so cute, yes. <laughs> such a cool experience to be able to crush coffee beans the old school way getting taught by the locals but unfortunately i don't think i've done it right but you know what the experience was so nice As mentioned, the village is around a thousand meters above sea level, which means the weather is interchangeable. Sometimes it was sunny and sometimes we were in the middle of the clouds. Late in the afternoon, the village received more visitors. So apart from us, there were people there from Germany, France, Portugal and a couple of other nationalities. It became a really friendly group. As there is no internet in the village, it was a lovely day just interacting with people and enjoying this unique experience. To spend the night at Vairibo village, we each spent 325,000 rupiah plus a 50,000 fee for the ceremony. As the day turned into night, we all came together in one of the houses and sat around and had some nice dinner, talking to each other and talking about our journeys. How are we going to build this? It's going to be like the dinosaur. We've done the feet already. We need to do the rest of the bits. Yeah? <laughs> yeah, you're doing it. You're doing it. We've got the guys some like Lego, but we're finding it a little bit difficult. Yeah. We're going to do it though. We'll show you what we get on, man. Then that'll fit on top. Look. Wow, wow. 
Where, where, where? Oh, <laughs> Waking up in early in the morning and spending time playing Lego with the kids and having a sing song was my favourite time of the whole experience. So we're walking back now. What a, what, what a great what 24 hour. What an absolute hour. adventure. I can only recommend this. We literally just walked two minutes to get up here. We're already out of breath. <laughs> oh no. But we just want to document that we're leaving at nine o'clock in the morning, sharp. And arriving, who knows? Who knows when. But it's been great. We met so many nice people, made some friends. Absolute eye opener of an experience. Yeah, the locals here are amazing. And the, the kids, everyone, is what, what an experience. Highly recommend to do yeah. this, guys. Look at this little village behind us. It's the <laughs> cutest thing and what a what a way of life. How privileged they are, even though they don't have that much compared to Western. It's complete peace and tranquility. I think we, we've got our values the upside down in Western world, but you know, <laughs> what can you do? We both had a coffee this morning and that coffee is strong. So uh, yeah, Cheaply. it's going to power us through. It's going to be a, a quick journey back, I think. Uh, but what an amazing experience. We'll definitely love to come back to this place. It's, uh, it's been eye opener, definitely. <laughs> Absolutely. The last 24 hours has been spectacular. We hope you enjoy the journey with us and we can't wait to see you next time. Until then, peace. Peace.